fix is coming. When? I wish I could tell you that it was going to be tomorrow or next week. I can't tell you that. I don't have any better of a crystal ball than anyone else, and I certainly don't have a magic wand. But I can tell you that we are actually truly working on a fix. We've got a, a group that's meeting, trying to gather the data. I want to point out just one brief thing. This is not a new issue. This issue didn't just come up two months ago. This issue has been an issue for actually decades. The problem is there's not a lot of data to inform the issue. A lot of good ideas, a lot of things that make sense, but if we are going to do what we love to call data-driven decisions, we do need, in fact, some data. We need to make sure we're all counting in the same manner. I realize that counting goes one, two, three, but different people count actually in different ways based on money, based on head count, based on, on uh, a lot of different factors. But I do believe that the General Assembly will address the issue in sufficient time to allow the LEAs, principals, superintendents, county commissioners to make the adjustments necessary. Now you've been, uh, to your credit, I follow you on Twitter, you've been traveling a lot. You've been yeah. talking to districts. You, you acknowledge this is a real issue, right? I mean, this, this is a real issue. This is a problem. This is not, okay, you, you're, look, you're looking at data, but you're seeing it here with your own And everywhere I go, I, by and large, I hear the same stories with regard to what, or what's going to be required of the individual LEAs. I want to make one more thing clear. I've not heard one member of the General Assembly tell me uh, that enhancement classes, a term I abhor, by the way, music, art, PE, are not enhancements. They are fundamental to a good education. hearing from no one that we want to dissolve or denigrate our ability to deliver all of the types of courses that are fundamental to a good education for everyone. Right. Senator Fushi. So I agree with everything that Representative Corn has said, but I think um, just saying that the fix is coming um, is not enough because the fix should have come post haste. Um, I think that it's clear is that this is an issue that affects every school district in this state. It affects every county's ability to fund schools adequately. And given where we are, this is January, uh, my experience from being a school board member uh, reminds me that those budgets are usually forwarded to the county commission somewhere in May, and county commissions don't have the luxury that the state government has in terms of when this budget has to be approved. So understanding that it has to be approved by June 30, we need to make sure this is done and not just to kick the can down the road, we need to provide a real fix so that things can be done correctly.